move into the Premier League has finally been sealed and in the last episode I made my debut in Premier League football playing against Fulham getting my first tackles in my first passes and winning the game in the end and picking up three points for that man's team look at you all sexy Gianni is currently playing for Aston Villa and it has been a turbulent start, if I might say so. But I want to say massive thank you to all of you guys in the comments down below. Honestly, the interaction on this series is ridiculous. Over 136 people have left a comment. And it's not just like short comments. It's unbelievably detailed comments many, many times coming through. And there is one thing that I could tell from this right here. People would have loved to see me play in that center midfield role. But since Aston Villa doesn't offer that position and plays two number sixes, I am reduced to become a C becoming a CDM. And in terms of the videos moving forward, it's just not going to be as exciting as you guys have realized as well. It's just not incredible to go ahead and put in tackles all the time. It isn't going to interest people long term. So what I had to do is... I had to find a spot for myself and hopefully me choosing to not be a number six is going to allow Kamara to play as a six and then hopefully not Tielemans but Aleix Garcia plays as the other six. I want to play with Aleix Garcia on the pitch, one of my current favorite players in world football and for that reason I've become a left winger. Yes, I want to play in the left midfield, left wing position for Aston Villa. The reason why I chose left wing is because I wanted to be a little bit more attacking. I wanted to go ahead and improve my shooting stats and stuff. And if I do that as a left wing, I will get a higher overall rating. And when you're a left midfielder, I believe the shooting isn't as important. It's more about passing and even defending as well. So I wanted to be an attacking option properly for this side. And on the left hand side, there is is there no one? Wait, didn't we have Ramsey in here or something? Yeah, there we go. We have Jacob Ramsey playing in the left midfield spot. And it does say he's approached by Borussia Dortmund. So this could be the perfect opportunity to, for me to become a left wing and just take that spot to the next level, get goals for this team. And that in hindsight, also not in hindsight, but whatever the word is, means that I can go into the player agent and start my path again. Because as a CDM, successful one-on-ones, which was something that uh, Atletico Madrid was looking for, was the objective I could possibly achieve. But now, I could actually be looking at teams like Barcelona again. Now, Barcelona want me to score four hat-tricks. Oh boy, that is going to be quite interesting. What about if we edit the wage? Oh, we can bring it down to three. So I can technically edit my wage right there and go for Barcelona just like that. But Technically speaking, I don't really care about my wage. I really don't. I just want to join the team. I want to, I want to, uh, uh, like take my game to the next level with. And looking at Barca, that'd be fun because I do feel like Barca needs more help than Real Madrid. And Real Madrid joining the Galacticos, I would have to go ahead and get successful passing goals, 72 of them. We can do that. Hat tricks, three of them, and appearances. That should be fine too. So. Man, I could actually have the opportunity to join two of the biggest clubs in world football. And that is going to be my goal. And halfway through the season, I think I'm going to have to make my decision which team I want to join. But now, for now, we need to focus on Premier League football. I have become a left wing Aston Villa. Let's get this season going again. But sadly, because I've become a left wing, my manager rating has gone down. So I have to earn my way back into the starting 11. Chelsea is the next opponent of our team. Callum Wilson gets off and I am now coming on for the squad in the 79th minute. They do have a red card, which I need to take advantage of. I'm going to go with the shot on target coming on as... What, the, what position am I actually playing? Oh no, that's coming right at me. Go on, find me. Keep up. Go on. What are you waiting for? Lovely. Okay. Can I do something with the first touch in this game? Oh my god, that was nearly out. And I actually need to go ahead and improve my personality in terms of like the traits that I have. Lovely. Inside the box. Cutting in. Near post. Yes. The new Johnny. The old Johnny is back. The goal scoring one. Aston Villa. You need to watch out. Premier League. Watch out. I am going ahead and going for the trophies with this team. I want the individual ones 
And I also would love to take Aston Villa to a title. That would be incredible. Left wing is the spot I belong to. Oh, Chelsea, get one back. See, it was good that I got that goal because that way we are still in the lead. 2-1 against Chelsea. Beautiful strike from Caicedo. I'll give it to him. And I actually think I might have come on as a striker, lads. Because the left wing is still occupied by Ramsey as far as I can see. Find me. Oh, beautiful. One, two. Find me again. Yes. Go on then. Down the left wing. Look at me. Scoring. No, you gotta be kidding. How did I not score that? Watch out. I'm a bruiser. I'm a tackler. It's still in my jeans. I might not be playing centre mid CDM, but I'll still take you down if I have to. Oh, Chelsea, please don't score late into the game. This could be extremely painful. Emmy Martinez, you're a legend. Yes, you are insane. Oh, keeper's out. Can I cover him? He, he nearly went for it. Go on, the lad, find me again. Yes. <laughs> Let's go. I might be able to score off of here. Yes. <laughs> Yes, the counter-attack of dreams. Look at the goalkeeper still going down. That is me getting two goals on my attacking debut. What a shot, by the way. It barely moved in the air. Chelsea is beaten. 3-1 away from home. Aston Villa fans, now I have properly announced myself to the club and everyone else in the Premier League. Just gone ahead and invested a little bit of money into commercial property. Uh, the returns could be going up to 3.8 million, so why not? And obviously, now that I've become an attacking player, I really wonder how it's going to go. What position are, gonna, are they going to play me in? Because we are playing with two strikers. I don't necessarily want to play striker. I really, really hope I get to play in that left midfield position. And I hope that the fact that I'm a left winger instead of a left mid doesn't ruin that dream for me. And I just want to double check here as we're in the menus right now. Um, have they sold Ramsey? Has he, has he left? Okay, so Santos has gone out on loan to Augsburg. That's interesting. And Ramsey's gone. Yes, Ramsey has left the club. Okay. Now that is interesting. Has anyone joined that would catch my... Eva Nilsson. Okay, the Porto striker has now joined the team too. So I might be able to play behind Julian Alvarez and Eva Nilsson. Two players who can clearly still grow. Oh, mate, Aston Villa is building some team right here. Has anyone else joined that I didn't realize yet? Is there actually a spot I can go into and just check which players have come in and all that good stuff? I need to I need to go in there. I mean, the fact that Diogo Costa joined and is not playing is so funny to me. But there is no transfer section here, which really sucks. I mean, there's so much missing in my player. EA, you got to be doing much better than this, man. Give us a lot more control, a lot more stats to look at, a lot more things in general. I mean, hell, I can't even check out the starting 11 of my team. But hey, let's go in here and see it. I'm going to come on as a left striker. Okay, that will be quite interesting. Me alongside Alvarez. And we are 1-0 down against Arsenal. Can I turn this around? No. I really hope this doesn't turn into a regular thing. I want to be playing in a different position. Find me. Oh, go on. I do have good shooting on me. No, that was not bad, you know. Move it. Find me again, Alvarez. Down the left. We have so much space. Oh, that's beautiful playing. Who is that? I don't know who that is. But can he find me? Ooh, where are you playing the pass to? I was completely open. Hold on. Still have time here. Oh, what a tackle. A foul has been given. Do I take it? Do I take that free kick? No, it's not me. I'm going to be right in there, though. Waiting for the offside trap. Arsenal turning and shooting and nothing coming off of it. And they nearly scored a freaking own goal, mate. Down the wing. Bukayo Saka, I believe that might be. Right next to me. I'm moving into the box. Turning, twisting, finding the pass. Go on, let's do something with it. Yes, let's go. 88th minute, it's Alvarez. 
<coughs> Are you dying? All right, we'll take it. Sorry about the cough. But, mate, this is a moment. 1-1, not losing against Arsenal. Big moment for Aston Villa. Ooh. There might be a little bit of space down this left wing. Oh, beautiful play. Oh, what a second. Let's go. 89th minute. Can you believe it? We actually did turn it around. Oh, mate, I'm loving Aston Villa already. It is so nice to play alongside people who know how to play football. Augsburg, I'm sorry. I really don't mean it badly, but this team is different gravy. We are doing so much better. Rudiger, what are you doing up there? Bro, it's 1-1. Why is he pushing forward so much? In the end, he gets himself an assist. Julian Alvarez is the hero of the day. And the game did turn around when I did come on. And I did play a small role in every goal. So I will take that with me. Yes, find me. Let's go. Let's go. I'm running down the wing. I'm holding on to this ball and not giving it to anyone. Oh, hold on. There's an opening. Oh my God, I'm trash. Yes, you are. Oh, wow. Okay. That was horrific. Oh, wow. I'm glad it's 2-1 already because if it was still 1-1 and I missed that, I would have asked the coach to sub me off. Go on, lads. Put pressure on him. Three points at home. 1-0 down because of the goal of Daniel Marlin. But then a man named Johnny came on and everything turned around. I really hope the coach realizes that I'm consistently having a massive impact on this team. And yes, he probably also saw that I just missed a sitter. But hey, forget about that. Forget about it. I just leveled up once more and I'm deciding on what to improve. And clearly it should be finishing. I mean, <laughs> we saw what happened. So let's go ahead and improve that a little bit. I still have one more point uh, to spread. Long shots could be fun because I do want to score some bangers, but at the same time, I feel like crossing and stuff will be important too. Passing specifically will be very important. Dribbling, ball control to 99. Is that really necessary? I already have 95. Stamina. Oh yeah, that's important. Stamina. I'll go stamina on this one. Get it up to 75. That's going to be useful. I'm on level 35. How far does it actually go? Let me know in the comments. Okay, slowly I'm getting a bit worried. I'm constantly getting subbed on as a left striker, but it's okay. Also, I'm seeing Dendonker play instead of Alex Garcia, and that does my head in, but that's a completely different story. It's nil-nil. I'm getting 32 minutes of play time. Watch out about what I'm about to do. Watch out about what I'm about to do. What does that even mean? <laughs> is that what am I saying? <laughs> is that even English? What the hell? Garcia is not even on the bench. Okay, then, Donker. I might have to break your legs, pal. I see that run of yours. Good pass. Julian Alvarez. Oh, that's a good cross, but it's offside. Man, what a finish as well. 71st minute. Sadly, it doesn't count. Referee. I know you're right. It was a little bit too early. Yeah, look at that. Everton, 77th. Paul Torres can't stop it. It's 1-0 to Everton. That is not what I expected. Dele gets the goal. Congratulations to him. Happy for him, but still, it's a disgrace that we're not able to win this game. And I have to say, every single touch I've had so far has been a disgrace too. So I can't blame the team. I got to blame myself too. Let me. Yes. Good ball. Oh, beautifully played. Come on. Go far post, man. What are you doing? Oh, wow. We are being brought back down. Oh, that's incredible. Everton beat us. I did not expect that. Aston Villa, I'm sorry for my horrible performance here. Now, you guys didn't really see much of it because I didn't really have too many moments here. But every time I touch the ball, I feel like I messed up. So, yeah, that's a great pass, by the way. Beto, quality finish. First time. My first loss in the Premier League. And as we went into this game, we were in the first position. Now it's all gone. So right now, after four games, we are still up there in the top four, right? Manchester City and Newcastle United unbeaten alongside Manchester United, who are a bit lower down the league table. Our next opponent is Liverpool, who are currently in, in the seventh position. If Liverpool beat us, they get into our position. So 
I'm still a substitute. I'm still working on it. I'm going to earn my spot in this team. But what do we have? It's 1-0. Okay, come on. We've done it once. Can we do it again? We did it against Arsenal. Can we do it against Liverpool? It's at our home ground again. At least one thing needs to happen, and it is that is not to lose. Alvarez, see me down the left. I see another run. That left-hand side is amazing, by the way. Find me! What are you waiting for? I'll go for the shot near post. I mean, I knew that would never go in, but I wanted a corner. Who did go? Oh, go on! Alvarez! Oh, mate, it's so nice to not have to do everything by myself. I am Julian Alvarez, his biggest fan. That is for sure. That man is just unreal. Look at his movement. Bang, there he is. First touch. Go. Find me. Go. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, no, it's Alfonso Davies next to me. Ah, it's that same freaking angle again. I need to shoot that with my left boot. Go for like a Trevella or something. Or I need to go like near post. Full power. Man, oh, that will cost us in the end. I can feel it. Oh no, will it cost us already? Davi Nunez has a clear opportunity to pass it. Decides to go for something very silly. And I have the space down this left-hand side. Beautiful ball from Emi Martinez. I'm sorry, whoever is number two. I'm not going to pass it to you yet. Now... Go! No! Alvarez didn't score. It also wasn't the best idea for me, but I'll take it. Left foot. That's a horrible shot. Great defending. Hello? Why is he not defending that? Why is he letting him run through? Oh my God. I thought that was it. All right, defend this with your life. I'm going to go for it. Oh no! It's a crossbar. And it's out. I'll take it. 1-1. One, one. We didn't lose. That's the bare minimum that I wanted. I did have my chance to win this game. And next time I need to be doing better, that's for sure. Oh, I'm just seeing that we are part of Conference League football. That's great. That is actually good. Look, I would have loved Europa League. I would have loved Champions League, obviously. But at least there is a European trophy to go after. And Conference League, man, it needs a lot more respect. I love the games in the Conference League. I've been watching a bunch of them last season and the season before. It is actually so nice to see some of the smaller sides get the chance to play at a high level against teams from other countries. So yeah, I am all for it. Basel is going to be the opponent that I'm going to step up against. And uh, in terms of my targets, inside the box goals, okay, hat-tricks, matches in the starting eleven. All of that hasn't happened yet, but once I become a starter, things are going to be looking up big time. I can feel it. Oh, and I keep forgetting. Hold on a second. We need to get rid of these silly play styles. Yes, technical. Give that to me. Power shot. Let's go. And then the final one. That's the one where I got to like think about what do I want to have? Long ball pass, incisive, power header. Ooh, power header. That could be cool because I will be at the end of some of cr some of the crosses coming in from uh, corners. So I'm actually all for it. Yeah, let's take that. As we go into this game, I'm coming on as a left striker again, which uh, right now I don't really bother with that because I am playing a little bit off the left anyway. So it's okay. It's not like I'm the lone striker at the moment. But one thing I want to mention is I was trying to injure Dendonker and Tielemans, but these boys are just jumping out the way in the training session. Translated to cheat engine talk. For whatever reason, my cheat engine won't launch. So I cannot injure them as we speak, but their day will come. By the way, what does that trainer level at the bottom right actually mean? I have no idea what it's about, but hey, it's fine. Let's go ahead and get a goal or an assist or two. Ooh. Is that offside? It is not. Let's go! What a finish! Ha <laughs> That is another goal for me! I mean, it's not the best of teams, I'll be honest. Basel is terrible. They constantly lose the ball. I was pretty confident I was offside, but no, it's perfect timing. And an even better finish on top of it. I was having a horrible game up until this point. Despite scoring, I'm still on a 7.6, which should tell you everything. Ooh, what a ball that is. Is Alvarez going to be in there? Or am I going to do this by myself? I might just. I might. Uh, come on. Score that. Go on. Go on. 90 plus two. 
I want to get another one. I need two goal contributions, right? Cutting in. Pass. Or do something with it. Alvarez, I need two goal contributions to finish the enhanced target, but it's fine. I kind of ruined that myself. I probably should have taken a shot, but at the end of the day, an 8.5. Can't really complain about my performance on the pitch today. So I'm a happy boy. A win in Europe. Let's go. So let's check my stats so far into the season at Aston Villa. After having played six games, the team has Julian Alvarez up top with five goals and two assists. And right after that, it is me. Yes, I am on three goals and an assist. Four goal contributions, same as Diaby. There seems to be three players who are dominating the games right now. And Emi Martinez, man, he's doing a great job. I'm actually wondering, when is uh, Costa going to be playing? He already played one game. I can't remember which game that must have been. But Olsen also got one, which is a disgrace. It should only be between Martinez and Costa. And uh, I actually find it very interesting how things have evolved. I wanted to be a left midfielder. I'm playing as a left striker. I wonder how it's going to go once I actually become a starting 11 player. As you guys can see in the top left, we're very close to getting there. And in terms of like my stats and stuff, if you guys have any suggestions to get an even higher rating, let me know. But as things stand, I'm actually pretty happy with, my, with how my player is playing. Yes, I could be doing a few things better than I've done. My finishing in front of the target at some points with like tighter angles has been quite bad. The finesse shot is maybe something to go for moving forward. That maybe is another thing that I need to choose here because the power header, I don't know if that's going to come into play too much. Is there a finesse shot trait? Oh, is there none? I thought there was one with the simple ones, but I guess not. Which one is the finesse shot? Huh? I'm confused. So I just have to improve my curve then. Is that what it is? Oh, well, it is what it is, guys. My journey at Aston Villa has only started... We're going for multiple trophies. Yes, I want to take Aston Villa to the top of the Premier League. But in order to pull that off, there's a long, long road ahead. And hopefully, you're going to be with me up until that point. Have a good day, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. Take care and peace.